Okay, we're back. Uh, <laughs> I've been doing a lot, and we still have more to do, I guess. Well, everyone knows about the new DLC. I guess everyone knows. Uh, I won't be playing it because obviously it's you know we have to pay for it, and <laughs> I pay. I I take what the game gives me. We have other DLCs we'll be able to do that the game gave us to do when the game first came out. Um, and then I think there's, you know, Dublin, I think, and, and uh, you know, there's the, the uh, river raids and all this other stuff that we, we can do. So we'll do those. But, you know, there's other videos, other YouTubers that are playing the game, so that's fine. Um, right now, but <laughs> I gotta finish the first one. So let's go ahead and, and continue that. We do have, a, the, the, we did acquire the shorts for it. And I'm gonna try to uh, use that in a few battles here and there. <laughs> Can't make any promises, but we'll try. Um, because I don't think the sword is that, uh, is that as, as powerful as the swords or the other uh, weapons that I have. But we'll see. Uh, so let's continue. We got a nibs. Probably the, oh, and we can get rid of our helmet, I guess. <clears throat> he looks like a real <laughs> with the shield on his back. Um, let me see. I think we have everything full. Rations. Oh, we need rations, though. We did fool around a little bit. We killed a zealot. There we go. It wasn't too big of a battle, but it, you know, we of course we won because we used our. Uh, did we use this? Yeah, I think we did use the short. It took a, It seemed to have taken a little bit longer. Then it did with. Um, It's on the other side. So hopefully we can get uh, the North Quest taken care of. And then what we'll probably do is uh, go south and do some exploring before we actually do. Maybe it's this house. <clears throat> before we actually do the quest down south. Oh, I don't know it's uh, right there anyway. Let me see. Yeah, right there. Yeah. Is this the, I don't think this is the, no, it's over here. Somewhere. <laughs> um, right there. For the stable. Heroes of plenty, warriors. Hey, you, my eyes and souls do not just. Uh, is this in here? Heroes yeah, of plenty, okay. warriors so many, but most walk about with heads that are empty. Oh. Would a soul in these lands what? pay heed to a man who wanders you know, this oh. world without a clan? Do do? A song I will sing for silver or a ring. Because a bard is me as true as can be. 
Okay, so final speech of mine, she lives in the southern area of the yeah, southern area. So, the Go, my eyes. Antonia, what? Jesus, we don't want another side. Oh, yeah, she lives here. Where was the, where was the ship? Oh, that's right. I came. I was here, and then I went around looking for the stable. Yeah, the ship's over there. So she's around here. Okay. <laughs> I guess we could have taken the horse. Would a soul in these lands pay heed to a man who wanders this world without a clan? A song I will sing. I guess we could have taken the horse over and then. Yeah, just parked it over there somewhere. But you can see, you know, there's no horses. Uh, no one's taking, you know, no one's taking any horses around here. So let's see. Even our marker is gone. Yeah, but which house is she in? Look like she must be in this one with the. Not here. Uh oh. With haste. This letter came from Weekend. She must have gone there. Okay, so go now to we go back. <laughs> Find Moira. No, we'll, we'll just call the horse. Ship is here, and then we have to go. Oh, we can do it here. Fast travel. Okay. Now that we're here, show me what lies ahead. She's in the little hut, little house right in front of us. It's a small village. Moira's house must be near. I like him there. Here. <laughs> she moved again. Oh, that's something else. Oh, okay. Not telling us anything. Okay. So I guess we're on track, maybe. I don't know. Why would she be down here? Oh, yeah, I think so. Oh, there's nothing. <laughs> right. 
running into a brick wall. Okay. I mean, not a brick wall, but. There's no wall. Let me see. Oh, gee, if she. Showed this at before. Now all of a sudden, yeah. it should be at somebody's house. That's what it's saying. here each finest people what do you see what do you see How come in my uh, pointer doesn't show? Oh, let me see. When you click on it, let me see. Asked about this lab, my friend. No. Today. What is this ruckus? Stand back, Jane. There's a witch within that house. We've come to burn it down. She's no witch. She's Hafton's healer. That proves it. Dark magic, that is. Clear out, all of you, before I beat you senseless. They're getting too long. They think some spirit's trying to take over their body. Seriously, I'll do. I saw one thing, a weaver, jump up, clutch his nose and scream in supplications. Claimed bad spirits were tormenting him, trying to get up his nose. We can't go inside anyway because everything is barred. We need to see and if they want us to go inside. To before they bring the blaze down. Oh, goodness! You're not. not one of them! You must help me slip free! Moira, we must go. Before they burn your cutters to send us. I can't go out there. They'll steal me away and burn me at the stake. All right. I see two ways out of this, but neither is without risk. Do what you must, only hurry. I leave myself in your hands. <laughs> I'm as good with words as I am with weapons. It will take some convincing, but I can talk my way out of this. Lead on then. I shall follow. You only leave if the mob disperses. So let's go back and talk. I don't want to lose it all that. I just don't want to do it. 
<laughs> it's funny because you can be, you know, you can be arm, <coughs> arm, excuse me. <laughs> Go home, all of you. This woman is in my care now. Who died and made you sovereign of Northumbria now? I am the wolf kissed, killer of men, feeder of ravens. Stand back, or I will wear your bones as ornaments. Jesus. He's up now. We was only protecting our hamlet here. Tell Hafton he can have her. Uh, leave this woman alone. Even look her way again, and it will be the last thing you see. Moira, <laughs> it's safe to go. We'll be safe here. Thank you, Eivor. A thousand times I thank you. And if I asked you to drink your own brew? I would, gladly. And often do from time to time, to ensure it's not overly bitter before serving to Hafton. When you said there's no cure for what ails Hafton, you mean his touch in the head? I fear so. The same malady bedeviled my mother. The body breaks down and the mind falls apart over time. It's a terrible thing. What goes in your blue can? I need your help, Moira. Take one at a time. The brews you mix for Hafton. What goes into them? Oh, quite a diverse mixture. Let me see. Lavender, rosemary, meadow sweet, yarrow, soothing herbs, nothing uncommon. I should return to Hafton. He said he would be at the Temple of Flora. Tread lightly this topic with him, if you would tread it at all. I'm probably butchering a name. Let me see. I guess that's what this one. Oh, that's uh. Yeah, no one. This one, I think. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And let's get rid of the uh, markers. Here, how do I zoom in? Oh man, I keep missing. <laughs> I'm pressing the wrong button. I forgot how to work this thing. Man. Okay. okay, so let's go back here. Know where to fast travel? This one here. This one here. Take the horsey. Let me see. We'll mark it here. There we go. Oh, way. <laughs> it's a way. Hope you'll be all right, huh? You're <laughs> not gonna let us uh, speed things up.
lot. Well, I say a lot going on, but there's a lot of new. Um, all the games, most games that are out now. Not the new stuff, but the you know the stuff that's been out for a while. They have a lot of new DLC, a lot of you know new seasons starting. <laughs> so uh, even mobile games, you know, so they're tweaking this a few things here and there, giving you extra skins or extra perks, and especially if you have like uh, um, you know a gold pass or whatever they want to call it. Get extra skins and all this other good stuff. Let's see where I'm somewhere. Maybe right here somewhere. Aid me. Be my eyes. Where the hell is it going? Straight ahead. Fighting all of this push anyway. I like to fight in the open. Still straight ahead. In the direction I'm pointing. Often, good to find you here. The Raven Feeder returns. Now keep quiet. I'm hunting a band of traitors lurking about this swamp. Who told you there were traitors here? My scout. He asked me to join him here, but he is nowhere to be found. Have a look around. Tell me if you see something. Eivor, search the perches and lookouts here. We could be spying from above. Olav, speak to us. Where are you? You might be scouting from my vantage point. And the vantage point is over here. <laughs> I didn't see the rope. Where is he? Oh, uh oh. I'm dead. He's clinging to life. I should carry him down. to carry him down.
love. I found your scout, but his wounds are grave. Olaf. Poor Olaf. He will be buried with honors. I will see to that. Walk the bridge, old friend. I will see you on the other side. Be Anton may track his attackers. Get them, boy. Good boy. Follow their trail. <laughs> Sniff them out, boy. We will paint the ground with their blood. Yeah, we don't have any witches. <laughs> Who are these men you suspect of treason? Thieves who stole my war spoils. Looks abandoned. Are you sure someone is here? Trail ends, but nobody's here. Hmm. Uh, Bubba's here. There's a key downstairs. We've been here before. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll have to break this. Here, a hidden entrance. It might be lurking below. You have done it. You must hurry. These pipes <laughs> burst and flooded the tunnel. Even this old Roman work cannot withstand the icy kiss of winter scholars. Yeah, because we've been Look there. The pipes cut through that wall. Could there be more rooms beyond? Hold on, we'll find a way through. Could have gone the other way. We're gonna need explosive pipes. This way? Or is open? Oh, this is it. Give me a hand over here! Couldn't get through here before we had to. We had to uh, do the story. Where is he? <laughs> He's supposed to. He's supposed to be coming with us. Where is he? Did he go this way? Or is he still upstairs? That's where you throw the explosive. Let me see. He might be still upstairs. Let me see. Where is he? Yeah, he's still up here. <laughs> Dude, he's supposed to be coming down. Oh, she with the scotch. Okay. Wait a minute. You have to come with me so we can open the door. Oops. Let's see. Around this 
way. This way. There we go. The Romans were fine craftsmen. These chambers are vast and decorated, and laced with piping. Yet they went mad and vanished, just like their gods. Moira's books tell us so. Ah, here, you see? Spoils of war. Mine! Stolen from me! <laughs> ah! I am beset on all sides, Eivor. By plotters and schemers. What kings and jarls are not. Your territory is vast and wealthy. Every day, decisions I make change the lives of thousands. It is a burden few could bear. Yet I do. I do. You spoke with Moira. What did you learn? She means well. I don't believe she would poison you, not willingly. Mm. She also said she has seen your illness before, in her own family. Said it came on slow, but was incurable. No. No, this is not an illness. This is poison. Somehow someone is poisoning me. Shh. Listen. These will be the thieves who stole my tribute. Okay, so... There's a key here. It supposed to lead us to some treasure that we couldn't get to before. So we have to remember <laughs> we have to remember where that is. Let me see. Uh it doesn't show here. Shoot. So we're gonna have to kinda be aware. Let me see part of the devil's find the source of the voices. We're gonna have to use Odin's uh, guest, whatever they call it. Okay, upstairs. And then we'll have to. Let me see. I can't remember which way that goes. It's the same, it goes that way. But I don't want to miss anything. <laughs> I need to go that way then. This is go this way. Unlock it. Okay.
Wolf kissed and half done. Well met. Come, fill your bellies with mead. You stole this tribute. By rights, this is mine. It was meant for me. We stole nothing. Faravid gifted this to us for a hard day's battle. And did you take my scout Olaf in that battle? Your brother in arms? Did he too have to die for this tribute? That was. That was Olaf? Damned fool! We thought he was a thief! The only thieves here are the ones drinking my mead and spit shining my silver! You! Cowards and traitors! We are owed this bounty, Jarl! For battles won and blood let! Eivor, you tell him! This is treason, and treason is punishable by death. Faravid treated us better than you ever did. Faravid is nothing, and you are less. Glory! Glory for Ulfra! They forced my hand. Take hold of your fear, Hafton. It can poison your mind. Faravid killed this man, not me. He forced my hand with slights and trickery. He... <coughs> Forgive me, I... I find it hot in these furs. The day must be warming. You have a meeting with Faravid. Is that not right? I do, at the waltz. Yes, I know the place well. It is on the road between Jorvik and Picheringa. Press him, Eivor, as hard as you can. Never let up, and bring me proof of his treachery, or otherwise. Traitors, thieves. No right. They had no right to... It's rightfully mine. Yes. Words are poison me.
I turned the sound down. Uh, I'm sorry. I turned my mic off. Uh, what was I saying? Um, well, we got the treasure down here. I was thinking that the key was going to lead us to another location. But I guess the key only led us to the outside. That helped us... Uh, Complete this quest. We just went around. Opened this door. First opened this door. Got the key. And we used the key. To open the other door. And that, 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 that took us up up top. Over here. Is where the. Like uh, trap. Yeah. Is where the uh, treasure was. So we completed that. So I don't think there's anything else. This just leads us outside. To finish the uh, the quest. So oops. Oh. Is it the right way? <laughs> oops. came down here, I can't get out. Oh, this way. Uh, no. This is the way you come in. But I thought we came, I thought we came, there was another exit. supposed to be some stairs. Oh, here they are. <laughs> I'm about to say, I've been going crazy. Where did the stairs go? Okay. So, up here. He's still here. Okay, let's go. We have to go to this area to go meet him. Where is it? He's up here. So we're at the woods. He's the Jarvik. He is somewhere. Let's get out of town. Oh yeah, see the, <laughs> the marker leaves. Now we gotta figure out where he is. Soon oh, guide way. me. Look at if I would be uh Join me in drowning this golden drink. What's this over here? Ah. Oh, we gotta do a thing. <laughs> you made it. Come, have a drink. You're a few horns deep already. <laughs> Yet still floating. Tell me, how did my old friend like his goblet gift? There were other things on his mind. Your man Ulfra, for instance. He died protecting the spoils he stole from Hafton. Ulfra. Poor Ulfra. I told him to mind your tongue, but he wags it like a slobbering dog. Was Hafton always so easily riled? No. 
Riches and glory have shaped him into something new. He's not the same man he used to be. The leader deserves his spoils. What happened to this camp? Uh, he does deserve his spoil. I don't understand. A Jarl is owed the spoils of war. To spend as he sees fit. So it has always been. That may be so, but Hafton hoards our wealth for himself, sharing neither gold nor glory. What is this place? I expected an army ready for Warcraft. This was our first camp in Northumbria. I came here with Hafton and his brothers, Uba and Ivar. We besieged Jorvik and put King Alla in the cold ground. Those were good days. Now, too far gone. What is all this? My share of the treasure we took from those distant days. I buried it here for a rainy day. This bag is heavy with silver. Enough to pay for an army. Come! Race me to Jorvik, Eivor. Remind me of the glories long gone. You're too drunk to win a race. Then have a drink. Mm -hmm. Make it fair. What's keeping you, friend Eivor, waiting for spring? Oh. Where are we supposed to be going? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, shit. <laughs> Your horse. Where are you going? Your horse can smell the ale dripping from your mouth. You frightened her. It warms my heart that you're concerned. But Mulda and I can hold our drink. Terrible at drinking. <laughs> I haven't. I, fi I figured out how to do it, but my timing is still a little bit off, I guess. Having trouble keeping up. Trouble keeping my up. horse must be deeper in the cups than I am. What are we doing in Yorick? You haven't said. Paying a visit to our kept King Rishie. Long may he reign. I haven't enough men to beat the Picts alone, but with Rishie and his fury, we'll finish them off. You would bring a puppet king into this fight, but not your yarl? Keep this to yourself. Yeah. The streets have ears, the windows have eyes. I did not agree to this level of deception. You should have told me this before. Eivor, my friend. If I describe my full strategy, we might never leave the campfire. I prefer the light of a fire to the darkness of your plans. Don't do it again. <laughs> yeah, so he, does, he makes all of these plans secretive. And he's, well... <laughs> But, you know, he's being sneaky about stuff. Huh? If he, if, uh, Eivor was doing this with Sigurd... Uh, Sigurd would have the same reservations. Revisions. <laughs> same the wrong thing. Uh, you know, suspecting Eivor of fighting against him. I've been afraid to touch even a drop of wine since the Yuletide feast. One more reason to stick. So he shouldn't be keeping, you know, he shouldn't be keeping things from coming in the yard. 
and if he have uh, ideas about them, he should share them. And let him, like I said, may, let him decide, or you know, decide as a clan or as a whole or whatever group or whatever. You know, I wish you'll die happened whatever. every month. The daily slaughter <coughs> kills me. Not if it happens. Not if it happens the way it did. But he keeps planning and plotting without uh, recognize, uh knowledge. Of what he's doing. I mean, he might be, he might have, uh, you know, good intentions, but at least, you know, share, Wait. share this information. A favor I must ask of you. Make no mention that Hafton is ignorant yeah. of our plans. It's better this way. Are you mad? Reach your answers to Hafton. You put this man in grave danger if he defies his master's will. Richie cannot defy orders he has never heard. No. Trust me, I will take the blame should our plan fall apart. Yeah, see, it doesn't make sense. And he'll take the blame, yeah, right. <laughs> he'll probably blame it on uh, Ivor. He's putting everybody at risk, making all these plans on his own. Eivor the wolf kissed and half done's cupbearer? What a curious surprise. I hope the day finds you and Jorvik well. Yes, we scraped by. With what little we still own. But this new war should make us wealthy once again. Until our tribute is taken. I smell the bile on your breath, King. Do not forget who is in charge here. Oh, do remind me, Faravid. Yesterday it was half done. But today, I hear whispers that you are leading the charge. I am confused. Yes, you answer to half done. And now, he orders one final strike on the picked stronghold at Magnus. To make war with the North on such a scale will require a hefty amount of silver and a large force of men. My soldiers and silver are pledged already. I expect the same from you. I have given my aid as well. The battle must be decisive. I see. And you have these orders from half done in writing, yes? From the great man himself? <laughs> half done does not know. To be clear, King Rishia, half done knows nothing about this attack. Nothing at all? That's unusual, Faravid. Eivor is mistaken, Lord King. I was given half done's personal assurance that you would volunteer your troops. He expects as much. But Hafton is ailing and tired. Let us not burden him with more worry, but please him with a swift victory. <laughs> I'm sorry, Faravid, but duty like compels to me to refuse. Without strict orders from Hafton, I will not risk the lives of so many. You deny me! I do. To gift you an army puts my wealth and reputation at risk. That's not what Hafton wants. He needs a strong and loyal king. You presume to know what Hafton wants. Without Hafton's formal approval, I cannot help. It's too great a risk. And after all, he is my ally. You understand? He trying to do all this on his own. <laughs> and try to take the glory for himself. I should break your arms for that. What were you doing? I saw no reason to hide the truth. Rishia is a Saxon puppet. He has more to lose than you and I ever will. That serpent cannot be trusted, Eivor. If he tells Hafton of our plan, our victory is at risk. Our victory is for Hafton's own benefit. We will secure Northumbria for him, along with the gratitude of all its Saxon and Norse subjects. Fine. Yeah, see, this is the problem. If we falsify orders from Hafton, Rishia will accept them. Pure of Jorvik could help. Good. Pure's favorite alehouse is nearby. Seek him there. I didn't speak to him. He might be at his favorite alehouse. Yeah, I mean, all, all we're doing is planning and plotting without Hafton's blessings. And um, he wants to take all the credit for him, isn't he? Okay, so we can have to. Our lands while the Saxons do nothing. The pigs are an eternal problem. Plotting beyond the wall, so I doubt. We come. Yeah, yeah. Our horse is still here. Oh, yeah. I don't like. 
I'm not that kind of a person anyway. I don't like to keep secrets and hide things and all this other stuff. He's just going about this all wrong. I mean, I understand the man is sick, but um, you know, I mean, this is the thing. If somebody had this type of attitude, you want to do all you can to make sure that they can trust you. And the guy continues to plot and plan behind his back. And then he put he puts Avor at risk. You know, he's the middle a guy that's, that's either trying to prove one thing or another. And so his, his back is, is against the wall. Let's stop here. And uh, we'll continue in the next video. It's just, it's just unfortunate, but you know, this is part of the quest I hate the most because <laughs> it's kind of confusing, but it puts your uh, values at stake.